with Syracuse. Plenty of space, Sergio Salcedo. I mean, after that first one, you know, the first one was obviously an incredible feeling. You know, it's put a lot of hard work in, you know, growing up just to get here and, you know, get on the team. And then, you know, now that, you know, it's starting to kind of pay off, you know, it felt incredible. But, um, you know, my dad always kind of jokes with me saying, you know, once you get that first one, they're all going to kind of start coming in. So, um, you know, I'm not really trying to think about, you know, too much, you know, points wise, just, you know, trying to produce and capitalize on the opportunities I'm getting and, you know, helping the team as much as I can. I think, you know, watching obviously a group, you know, like Galasso and, and, you know, Hakeem Leckie and Henry Schoonmaker, you know, kind of being a second line, third line guy, you know, just kind of learning from their mistakes, you know, being more of an observant guy. Um, you know, I actually have like a journal in my room. I write down like a lot of stuff that goes on in practice just so I can remember and like review if I need it. You have this nifty little back pedal yeah, that you're kind of right up your shot. Is that something that just comes naturally? Or a player back home, actually, Jake Bernhardt, who played at University of Maryland um, for a couple of years and he's actually in the MLL right now. He was big on getting your body into like every shot you take and you know me obviously being a smaller guy you know I need to really put a lot of force behind each shot. Um, so you know kind of shooting from my hips and getting my, my back turned it just kind of naturally gets my body to like rotate you know what I mean and it kind of beats like trying to maintain your balance so you don't look like you're like stumbling it just looks a little more like athletic per se. <laughs> I talk a lot about lacrosse. You can ask my friends. I joke around. Like I'll pretend I have a stick in my hands, like in the hotels or whatever. But I'm a big jokester. You know, I, I kind of I'm like a clown off the field. I'm pretty serious when I'm here, but outside of it, I'm you know usually known for being the guy who's cracking all the jokes and messing around a lot. <laughs> 2013 national championship was probably the best experience since I've been here. That was unreal. Uh, personal goals, you know, I want to win a national championship and team goals, you know, win a national championship, win an ACC championship. But I think honestly just taking each weekend and winning it, you know, each week, trying to win every week, trying to win every game individually, not really focusing on long-term stuff, but just doing, you know, taking it one one game at a time, really. He's open. He scores! Upper right 90. I don't think he needs